What's going on you guys, Angel Roboto here, and welcome back to Five Nights at South Park, where we'll be taking on Night 4 in this video. So without further ado, we'll take on Night 4 and see what has to offer for us. Okay, so, for here's a tip, for Kyle, once Kyle gets in your office, don't put up the camera, just look at him for a few seconds. Okay, so Kyle's going to have the same mechanic as Cartman, where we have to stare at him if we see him. Except Kyle's the opposite of Cartman. Kyle will come in the office and you have to stare at him. Cartman, you have to stare at him on the camera. Oh, here's Kyle. I see him. And I see Ike, too. Okay, so Ike is apparently attached to Kyle like they're conjoined twins. Which is pretty creepy but funny at the same time. Okay, and Kenny hasn't actually moved yet. Oh, here's Kyle. I see him. I'm checking for Kenny and Cartman. Okay, here's Cartman. Who doesn't want to move, apparently? He's just stuck on the camera. Oh, here's Kyle. Alright, so Kenny hasn't actually moved at all so far, which is a surprise. Okay, here's Kyle. I see him. And Ike as well. <laughs> Okay, so Kenny isn't really a threat this night, which is just a good thing because, um, because Kenny you have to react to in time or else he'll jump scare you. Oh, here's Kyle. I see him. Okay, so night four isn't actually as hard as I thought it was. It's actually kind of easy. It's not too bad. I thought night four was going to be tricky, but it's not actually. Okay, I'm checking my left side to see if Kenny will come for sure. Here's Kyle, I see him. Let me go check for um Cartman and Kenny, okay. Okay, Kenny hasn't moved yet and neither has Cartman. I mean Cartman's Cartman's on every single camera. Kenny hasn't moved yet, and I gotta look for Kyle. He's here. Okay, Kenny hasn't moved yet. I don't know I don't know why. Cartman only moved once. Kyle's been moving and so has um Stan. Stan I don't have to stand I don't have to worry about because I don't check the right side. Cause that's where Stan comes from, and if you check him when he's there, then he'll jump scare you. There's Kyle. Okay, we're already at 4 a.m., so that's a good thing. So, night 4 isn't as hard as I thought, actually. It's actually pretty easy. Because Kenny hasn't even moved yet. <laughs> I don't know why. That's kind of crazy. Okay, here's Kyle. Let me go check for Cartman and Kenny, even though Cartman's not... Even though Cartman and Kenny are moving. And we've made it to night... To 5 a.m. So that's a good thing. Alright, so we've beaten night four on the first try, so that was pretty easy. I'm glad I did. It wasn't as stressful. And since I got enough time left to record, we will take on night five in this video as well. So without further ado, we'll take on night five. See what that's not for us. But first, I gotta close out of the game, because as usual, my mouse is lagging. I don't know why. Okay. Alright, so on to night five. Survive until 5 a.m. Okay, that's the tip. Okay, so it looks like we're not dealing with any new characters this night. We just gotta survive until 5 a.m. Oh, here's Kenny. I, he's moving. Kyle's here. Ah! Cartman! Oh, I forgot about Cartman. And Kyle just killed me. Great.
Okay, get rid of Cartman. Now Kyle. Oh, Kyle just came back. Fuck. There's Kenny. Got him. Ah, Kyle! Oh, forgot about him. Uh, okay, so night five is going to be hard. It's harder than night four. Night four was only easy because Kenny wasn't active on night four. It was just Stan, Kyle, and Cartman. Now everyone is active on night five. Everyone's active on night five, and that's going to make it difficult. Okay, Cartman, get rid of him. Check for Kenny, now Kyle. Okay, Kenny. Check for Kenny. Kyle, there he is. And now Cartman. Okay, Cartman hasn't moved yet. Good. Oh, there's Cartman. He's moving, so I gotta... Ah! Oh, come on, Kyle. You're crazy. And I didn't notice this till now, but the jump scares are actually the same, same as in Tubby Land Return Act 1. Like, they're the same sound, which is pretty crazy. Cartman, get rid of him. Kyle, I hear him. And I'm checking for Kenny, too. Ah! Cartman! And Kyle, too. Okay, I got rid of Kenny, so that's good. Ah! Come on! Oh, my God. I, was, I couldn't react to Kyle in time. Great, now Kyle decides to be an asshole, not just Cartman. Kenny hasn't been as much of a threat in these later nights, so that's a good thing. And then Stan is not really a threat because... Oh, here's Kyle. I, I saw... I got him at the right minute. You're not going to stop me now, Kyle. Cartman, get rid of him. And he's not moving. Kyle, Kenny is moving. I, I saw Kenny move. Okay, got rid of Kenny. Perfect. There's Kyle. Okay, good. Okay, I'm getting rid of Kyle, so that's good. I saw Kenny. I see Kyle. Cartman is just on the camera. He's just staying on there for some apparent reason. And I've already died like once or twice on night five. I know, I've already died like two or three times on night five. Okay, I'm checking for Kenny. Is Kenny going to come or no? There he is. Now I can go check for Cartman. There's Kyle. I see him. Kyle's coming in again. He's, he's the most active this night, apparently. Whereas Stan's kind of the least... Stan and Kenny are kind of the least active. Okay, I got rid of Kenny. Now I gotta get rid of Kyle. And I'm gonna check for Cartman real quickly. Okay, Cartman is still on the camera. And then Stan, I don't have to check for since I don't have to check the right side. I mean, Stan I only see on the camera. Because I can't see him at the right side. And I can't check for him anyways. Okay, got rid of Kenny, good. Gotta deal with Kyle real quickly, then I'll check on Cartman. Cartman? Okay, good. Still on the camera. And I'm just constantly flashing the light on the left side for Kenny. And Stan's actually the only character I haven't been jump scared by in this game. Only because I haven't had it. Only because I don't have to check the right side. That's why. I only have to check the left side, the camera, and the office. 
Alright, so night five is a little bit stressful, but it's actually not as stressful, so that's a good thing. Because I've only died, like, what, three times. And I got killed by Kyle all three times. And then Cartman, I know, doesn't kill you. He just disables your camera. Okay, I'm checking for Kenny. I see Kyle. Got rid of Kenny. Perfect. And we've beaten Knife 5. Perfect. Alright, so Knife 5 was a little bit tricky, but we beat it nonetheless. That's good. So what do we have next? Oh, that's just the credits. Find out to South Park. Fan game created by Robo. Modeling and sound design, Robo. Some audio and editing, Zuri, Zuri Wulenda. Feedback, Martin Arthur and Sung Studios. Beta testing. Praga Pro programs used. South Park themes, Primus. South Park belongs to Trey Parker and Matt Stone. Oh, and this is actually a distorted intro. Okay, this intro is kind of distorted and dementing. Why are the Tubbyland characters there? Why are the Teletubbies characters there? That's pretty funny. Oh, anyways, and we've actually got a white star for beating Night 5, so that's pretty cool. And I'm going to have to close out of the game in order to check out the extras since the mouse is kind of acting up. I don't know why, but that's just stupid. Alright. So we've beaten Knife 4 and Knife 5 in this video. They weren't actually as hard as I thought, so that was a good thing. Knife 4 I beat on the first try. Knife 5 I died two or three times, but we beat it nonetheless because it wasn't too hard. And we've unlocked the extras, so let's check them out. And that's the South Park intro. Okay, we got Kenny, Stan, Cartman, and Kyle. That's what we got, which Kyle has Ike's head on him. Cartman is sitting. Stan's head is twisted. Kenny is kind of creepy. Okay, let's take a look at the jump scares. Okay, that's Kenny's jump scare. There's no sound. I don't know why. It's Kyle's. Stan's. Cartman's. Behind the sensor. Let's see. Unused characters. Oh, we got two unused characters, which is Terrence and Philip. Originally, these two were supposed to be in the game. Their mechanic was that you'd have to stare at them to stop them from getting into your office. If they got in, they would make a lot of sound alerting Kenny. Due to the due to time constraints and how the characters played a lot like disassembled, disembodied from Treasure Island, I scrapped them. They may come back in a sequel if I do plan one, but nobody knows. Alright, so Terrence and Philip were going to be in the game, but they got scrapped. Oh, and we have a custom knight too, so that's pretty cool. Alright, so we have a... Alright, so there's no knight... There's no knight six in this game, but there is a custom knight. Which I'm going to check it out. So, this is the custom knight right here. Oh, it's the end over South Park. Alright, so there is a custom knight in this game, which we will take on the custom night in the next video. Thank you for watching, everybody. Please hit the like button. Also, comment and subscribe. I appreciate all the support you have given me. Hit the bell for receive all notifications of upcoming videos on my channel. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.